this work we have chosen to uh, focus on Olympic legacy and healthy eating. For this we have surveyed 100 people in our local high street and we have got results from this and we can pass over now to Luke who is in the high street and has an enthusiast or sport to speak to you right now. Luke, I'm here with Matt. Hi. So do you think the Olympics has inspired a young generation? Yes, the stats have shown that more people are getting involved in sport. Do you think there's enough funding in this sport? No, I don't. I think there should be more funding so more people can get involved. Um, how much of the Olympics did you actually watch? I pretty much watched all of it as I found it very interesting. Uh, has the Olympics made people more aware of their health? Um, yes, because as you can see, more people are taking part in sports, which makes them healthier. Uh, are you facility in your local gym good quality? Yes, we have a range of equipment. We have cross trainers, treadmills, row machines, and a range of weights. Uh, what do you think the average amount of hours is you should do sport day? Well, I recommend about 20 minutes at least, and I do around two hours a day as I'm a proper hench. Thanks, Matt. Thanks for your time. And no problem. Back to you. Thank you, Luke. The Minister for Health has told us that, let alone obesity, will potentially cost the taxpayer England £50 billion by 2050, which is an unacceptable 740000 per year for the next 31 years, predicted by 2050. 90% of today's generation will be obese.